so this will be the ninth or tenth year that Belmont has been involved in high school quiz show. Usually around 120 teams try out and only the top 16 end up in the televised competition. So If you've ever seen Jeopardy, it's, it's similar to that, it's, but instead of um, being given the answer and answering with a question, um, there are multiple different rounds with different formats of questions. Um, every person has a buzzer uh, and certain rounds uh, if a player were to buzz in and buzz in incorrectly, it would lock the rest of their team out from answering certain rounds. That's not the case. For 10 points each, name these Caribbean countries. The leader, Toussaint Louverture, helped this former French colony gain its independence. 20th century leaders here included Jean Bernard Asclide and Francois Duvalier. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Escaped slaves, known as Maroons, fought the British in conflicts on this island country, whose cities included Montego Bay, Ocho Rios, and Kingston. Jamaica. Mm -hmm. Very key to be fast at buzzing. Um, oftentimes knowing the answer isn't the difficult part. Uh, it's it's buzzing in, beating up the other team. Um, uh, so everyone has their own strategy for that. Eleven years ago, the executive producer on the show, Hillary Wells, noticed that um, a lot of high schools would champion their um, more conventionally athletic students. You know, play football, play baseball, play basketball. But there really wasn't something for those who were just very smart and played on their quiz bowl teams. So that's kind of the genesis of how High School Quiz Show came to be. So it's a show that kind of gives these teams and these students an opportunity to um, uh, distinguish themselves from the rest of the student body. And this is the 11th season. Um, we're very excited. We got a brand new set this year, um, new graphics, new logo. Uh, so this is, uh, yeah, things are happening. So uh, today's match between Belmont and Salem Academy, who's making uh, its debut on Quiz Show for Salem Academy, uh, it is the last qualifying round match. The winner of this match will compete in the quarterfinals. And then from there, eventually move on to the semifinals, and then from there to the final. Don't be afraid to look down and hit that mark. So at the end of the round, I'll wait and go back to that. That's right. The round's over, go back to your desk. Um, Quiz Show is, in my opinion, um, just offers a fresh take and a fresh perspective on it. And we introduce WGVH's very high standards for production, and we just make it a great show. So the questions um, are the best questions around. Uh, we're, very, we're very proud of the integrity of our questions. And then we're able to get the community involvement. As you can see now, we're loading the set. Um, this show over the last 10 years has had over 13,000 people come over to watch tapings of High School Quiz Show. Um, so it's just the community participation, the community involvement um, that really explains a lot of why this show is, has been a success, but also the kids and the coaches that keep coming back year after year because they have a great time uh, on the show. It was very tense, but very exciting. It was a lot of fun. Uh, we were very impressed by how intelligent the t members of both teams were. Clearly, very very knowledgeable group. It was amazing. Uh, it couldn't have been a closer game. Uh, I I loved it. It's uh, every bit as exciting as I expected it to be.